This year, the University of Maine Graduate School celebrates 100 years of advancing educational opportunities and impacting workforce and economic development in Maine and beyond. UMaine has granted graduate degrees since 1881, when Walter Ballantyne became the first student to receive a Master of Science in Agriculture. He became the founding director of the first agricultural experiment station in Maine, supporting the growth of agricultural pursuits in the region and throughout the world. Persia Vinyl White, a novelist and successful businesswoman, was the first female graduate student from UMaine, earning her Master of Arts degree in English Literature in 1882. In 1923, the year of its founding under Dean Dr. George Davis Chase, the graduate school conferred 20 graduate degrees. The first PhD degree was granted in 1960 to Basil S. Farah in the subject of chemistry. Farah, who was born in Nazareth, Palestine, was also the first international student to receive a PhD. Today, the university's graduate student population contains representation from 74 countries and conferred a record-breaking 769 graduate degrees during the previous school year. The graduate school now offers 150 graduate programs, many of which are available partially or fully online. As a leader in workforce development, the graduate school is laser-focused on making a global impact while staying locally relevant. With its recent attainment of Carnegie R1 classified status, UMaine is set apart as one of the 146 top research institutions in the nation. As we look to the future, the graduate school will continue its long history of anticipating real-world needs while generating dynamic solutions that make long-term impacts on our workforce and economic development goals. Stay updated on future centennial events, dig into our history, and share your story. Visit umaine.edu slash gradcentennial.